Tony Finau, Hyper Ice, take one. These are superstars, these are the best in the game. These guys have been red hot all season. I think the reason they have so much success is everything is well calculated, same routine. Everything is very structured. 최대한 부상 방지를 많이 할, 그 방지를 하려고 이렇게 최대한 몸 많이 풀려고 하는 것 같아요. Leading up to a round of golf, I probably spend more time on my body than I do actually hitting balls and going out to play. It's come with experience. If the game feels good, I just need to be warm and then it's time to go play. This is a day in the hype. The way I handle the hype is, I guess, the way I've been handling my whole life. This is a beautiful 13th hole at Alpine Country Club. This is one of my favorite tee shots. A low fade like that. My dad always had this thing where it was like, when I'm on the golf course, you're on the golf course, and when you're at home, you're at home. Don't mix the two. So I kind of learned that at a young age, and I think that helps keep me grounded. Growing up dreaming of becoming a professional golfer, you envision playing the golf shots and winning the tournaments and lifting the trophies, but you don't envision the hype and the media and the noise and all that sort of stuff. I think everyone has to evolve and change in some way as a person, but hopefully it hasn't changed me that much as a person. But it's good. I mean, if you have that hype and that noise and that attention, it means you're doing good things. The range is a funny place. Just going through the years of playing, I can hit it great on the range and I can hit it terrible on the course. I can hit it terrible on the range and hit it great on the course. So I'm not that worried about how I hit it on the range. As I've gotten further into my career and a little older and a few more miles on the clock, it's just become more important each and every year to take care of myself. Trying to get your body in that similar place every single day is just going to help you replicate what you're trying to do with your swing. Before I'm actually playing a tournament, I'll only spend 15 minutes just because I mostly just want to be warm. I used to be a guy that just goes straight to the tee. The sooner you can pay attention to recovery, just the more healthy your body is going to be. And I felt that throughout my career. Health is wealth. And if you're not taking care of your body, I mean, what are you doing? Welcome to the big time. Rory McIlroy wins the Tour Championship and the FedEx Cup. All the greatest athletes in sports, they have shown incredible longevity in their careers, and that's something that I'm continuing to try to do. Roger Federer, Cristiano Ronaldo, Tom Brady, these guys that are playing you know, into their 40s or close to their 40s, which was unheard of 20 years ago. That's something I'm striving towards. I was sort of forced into the health and fitness aspect of golf because I had my fair share of back issues, especially earlier in my career, and I was told by a doctor if I didn't address these issues that my career could be a lot shorter than I wanted it to be. Earlier in my career, I was too flexible, too mobile, like sort of bandy and then that can cause you know inconsistency of movement so to get a little stronger to get a, a little more stable especially around my joints that's just being able to help me recreate the same swing over and over again consistently if you can make training difficult it means that once you're out there in competition it feels like a breeze and you can have fun When I turned pro at 18 years old, I didn't have really high expectations. Whatever the goal was right in front of me, that's what I wanted to achieve. And then once I achieved that, then I moved on to something else. That's the big thing. It's to never settle. It's to never think that this is the, the final destination. First win on the PJ Tour at Quail Hollow was a big one. It was a pretty hype moment. The major wins are huge. The players in 2019 was a big one. 
McElroy pours it in. I think FedEx Cup in 19 as well. How about this finish? And then I think back to the two Canadian Opens that I won. This Canadian crowd hoisted him on their shoulders across the finish line. Just the crowds there and the energy, they were pretty cool too. Not in a million years did I think that my journey in golf would end up with me being in this place. You always have these dreams and aspirations, but then at the same time, you want to be a realist and be like, okay, well, what is actually my potential here and what can I do? I think back to being 18 years old and going to stage one of qualifying school on the European tour and then turning pro and being able to get my card. So to win FedEx Cups. Rory McIlroy wins a third FedEx Cup title. It's exceeded what I thought I could do in the game. Put that tie at the summer. See a tie over there somewhere? And my taste in fashion has kind of grown. I didn't have the luxury of really having a super nice suit growing up, so now that I do, I definitely dabble a little bit. Being a Nike athlete, it's helped me be inspired by like some of the other athletes. Seems like a legit, legit look. Phenol Fresh came from my wife. She started our Instagram page, Phenol Fresh. And then early in the 2022 season, um, I started coming out as kind of like pregame looks with like Phenol Fresh outfits. Beautiful Utah, back home. 100% of the vibe. Look good, feel good, play good. Look good being the first part. My wife got me this sick, like, Kobe jacket. It's probably my favorite look. It was like a full suit, but it was like shorts. I was wearing some J's, and then on the inside, it was Kobe inspired. Phenol Fresh certified, as I like to say. Phenol Fresh is just our family, all the shenanigans. We try to keep it light and fun. We have kids that have a lot of attitude, a lot of personality, and we just like showing that to the world. My kids have been a huge perspective for me kept me positive, I think in moments where maybe I wouldn't have been as positive. I could be out here competing with these guys every week. That's my goal. I have the game to do it, just a little bit more experience and uh, I mean, you never know. It's funny watching that video. I definitely hear that eagerness in my voice, just my attitude. There's always something to prove. I definitely still carry that chip on my shoulder to this day. All the other professionals watching this guy hit balls. That was a huge moment in my life. It gave me belief that I could eventually get my game to a place where I could compete against the best players in the world on a weekly basis. Tony Finau, in his second year on the PGA Tour, his first career win. The game has brought me so much joy and gratitude, and it's humbled me in ways that I would have never expected. But that's what the journey's all about. It teaches you a lot about yourself and who you are. Look out for this guy with the talent that he has, the confidence that goes with winning on the PGA Tour. He could become a huge factor. true measure of your character and who you are or who you are in the tough moments and I kind of proved I think to myself and to the world that it's okay to still smile through the pain and eventually you'll end up on the good side of things. It's been 1,975 days since Tony's last win in Puerto Rico but this is a day he'll remember for a long time. I hope my kids know that even in the tough moments I try to always have a positive outlook and just have gratitude in life. 
put their initials on my golf ball because it makes me feel like they're with me. Tom, let's go. I was a pretty tough cookie to get through some tough moments and that teaches you if you work hard enough and have enough faith and hope in your future, good things can happen. Tony Fina, 3M and one big W for Tony. All parts of my game were really solid and the biggest thing was I just came off a winning week and was confident that I could do it again. I was still so zoned in to just getting the job done and I won by five, but it didn't feel like that until the last hole. Tony Finau is the winner of the 2022 Rocket Mortgage Classic back-to-back -back wins. The emotions that came out there were definitely spilling out from the support that I have. It was pretty unbelievable. It didn't hit me going back-to-back, -back, I think, until, like, I got home. It was a big surprise, but, man, it, was still, it still gives me goosebumps and chills because it's so cool. They had music blasting, and of course they wanted me to do the Dougie. You know, I had to show them the Dougie. For the third time in his last seven PGA Tour starts, Tony Finau is a winner. Something down? <laughs> wow, how about that? All these years, going through the struggle early on, and then getting to the tour and you know, trying to find my footing and to share these special moments. That's what the journey's all about. I think it's important to have a why, and my family is definitely that why. I want to do them proud, but mostly just they inspire me to be better and be the best version of myself. His first career win on the PGA Tour in his 50th start. And now here in Las Vegas, it is start number 100. It's gonna be a pretty solid bet that he gets a few more before that 150th. 하다 보니까 확실히 이제 몸을 안 풀면 좀 불안하더라고요. Looks like he's got everything going. Nerves are intact. The volume of tournaments that he plays, the recovery and preparation is is so key to staying healthy and performing at such a high level. 하루에 그냥 30분 정도는 몸을 푸는데 이렇게 관리하다 보면은 그래서 롱런 할수 있지 않을까 생각하고 있어요. He's going to have some great longevity. How about this man, red hot with a putter, pure, making everything. Wow, he is on fire. Well, rookie 때는 이렇게 시드 유지를 먼저 하는 게 목표로 했었는데 아무래도 루키 때부터 이렇게 투어 챔피언십도 출전하면서 어 나도 잘하면 이렇게 피지터 우승도 할수 있겠구나 이런 생각을 많이 했었던 것 같아요. 피지터 우승하면서 많은 자신감이 생겼고. No weaknesses to his game. Zero. Loves to play aggressively. Fires at every flag stick. He has such belief in being able to pull off those kinds of shots when it really matters. 이런 점도 점점 제 골프의 발전이 점점 되는 것 같아요. 그런 점을 많이 배웠던 것 같고 제가 처음부터 너무 높게 안 잡아서 생각보다 이렇게 결과 빨리 좋게 이렇게 나와줘서 지금까지 이렇게 잘할 수 있었던 것 같습니다. Personally and physically, you know, I think he's come a long way. This is kind of his time to relax and cut loose a little bit. He's a lot funnier than people realize. That's usually the thing that surprises people, and he, he can sometimes hide behind that language barrier, but he's very funny. Yeah. Sneaky funny. He's got a great personality. He's always in a good mood. 
뭐 코스 안에서 되게 열정적이고 열심히 하고 항상 이게 잘 찌기 위해서 많이 노력도 하고 어떻게 하면 잘할까 이런 생각도 많이 하면서 항상 하루를 보냈는데 어, 이제 코스 밖에서는 솔직히 이제 골프 생각을 많이 하다 보니까 그냥 좀 평범하게 그렇게 뭐 하는 것도 없고 그냥 쉴 때는 또 쉬는 거고 아 오늘 시작하기 전에 연습하러 나가는데 아침부터 좀 피곤한 것 같아요 아, 그래서 좀 정신이 없는데 더 열심히 연습을 하러 갈 겁니다 이동을 이렇게 하는 게 아무래도 체력적으로 많이 힘든 것 같아요 이제 어, 2주, 3주 이 정도까지 괜찮은데 한 5주 이상씩 제가 루키 때는 시합을 해봐서 그런 게 다음 장소로 이동하는 그런 이동 거리와 비행기를 많이 타는 게 제일 체력적으로 힘든 것 같습니다. 잘하려고 또 이렇게 항상 뭐더 좋은 성도 내려고 더 열심히 하려고 아무래도 그러다 보니까 많은 대회를 참가했던 것 같아요. 휴식 중 위치 있어? 응. 어? 잠 많이 자고? 중간에 깼어. 중간에 깼어? 네. 왜? 위치 찾아고 이렇게 피지트 올라오자마자 어, 시합 안 나가는 게 너무 아까웠던 것 같아요. 첫해 루키 때는. 근데 요새는 많이 저도 관리하면서 좀쉴때 쉬고 어, 출제할 때 출제하고 이렇게 하는데 아, 지금 웜이, 웜 제대로 하고 가네. <웃음> This guy could be the best player in the world. He plays with such maturity. And his demeanor is just fantastic. Confident without being arrogant. 제가 어렸을 때 골프 선수로 꿈을 커, 커왔고 뭐 지금도 이제 PJ 투어 와서 이렇게 5년 차 이제 시즌 들어가면서 제가 칠수 있을 때까지 몸 상태가 좋을 때까지 칠수 있는 게 목표고 그걸 하기 위해서는 제가 골프를 지금까지 너무 사랑하니까 너무 사랑하고 너무 좋아하는 또제 직업이고 그러다 보니까 아무래도 길게까지 어, 가고 싶습니다. 헬로우 having the time to go and practice and try to maintain being the best golfer that I can be. You want to put as much time into the golf as possible and you want to put as much time in as, as possible to your family too. So between the golf and, and the family time, there's not really much else that I do. I would love to say that I have like other hobbies at the minute, but um, I think most of my time is taken up with golf and training and family. Jupiter and, and, and the United States is where I need to be to be the best golfer that I can be. I think by living in Jupiter, my game has definitely improved. You not only have world-class facilities, you've got great weather year-round, but you can play with your peers and, and play with your competitors every day. Whenever I go to play a golf tournament now, I'm much more sharp than I would be if I wasn't living here. His technique is just so pure out of the sand. After my first win as a pro in Dubai back in 2009, I felt like, okay, well, if I can beat these sort of players on this sort of golf course this early in my career, with experience and with getting a little better, maybe I could become a major champion and maybe I could become the best player in the world one day. There is a new number one. Rory McIlroy is back atop the golfing world. It's just a gradual step by step and just always trying to get to that next level. Some years you see progress and other years you don't, but I definitely this year have seen progress to make me feel that, yeah, like this year was great, but the next five years can be even better. So I'm nowhere near the end. I've got a ton of golf left and I've got a, a clear route ahead of me. So I'm, I'm excited for that. <laughs> 